what to do, what to do, stop boy D. And today we've got a breakdown of a project that I've just seen, which is Hiri QY. First, we'll look at the art. Now the art, pretty good. This is Snick Peaks in the Discord. It's a Mahjong based NFT. This is awesome. This is awesome. One of the one of ones. Really sick. So we'll look at their Twitter. So you can see they joined in April. We've got 1,682 followers joined by followed by a few people. So guys, I'm not feeling well again, man. Do you imagine? So we can get into their roadmap. So after months of discussion and planning, 3QY has released an NFT collection that infuses an anime styled art with hints of Mijong elements, wanting to blend in a modern and traditional look. Our hand-drawn art has been carefully designed and detailed to show both traditional Japanese outfits and modern outfits. Okay. So spreading word, Mijong, you may have heard your friends and family mention about this game. I doubt you have. <laughs> To be very honest, you're gonna have to if you're if you're into this NFT and you want to have a look, you're going to have to learn how to play. And here's a tutorial here, not basic tutorial. So yeah, you can go there and learn how to play. Um, so you may have heard your friends and family mention about this game, or you might already be playing this game. There are so many different styles of mahjong, Rishi mahjong. Taiwan Mahjong, Hong Kong Mahjong, etc. And within each style, there are different strategies to adopt. 3QY plans to spread the love of Mahjong even further, attracting more players to learn and enjoy this beautiful game. So, merchandising. So, a fully customized Mahjong tile set and chip sets will be designed and put for sale after our NFT launch. Sell proceeds will be additional funds that we will reinvest into our plan in phase two. By the way, exclusively for our whitelist holders, holding a 3QY NFT would allow you a high percentage of winning a fully customized Mijong tile set, which you will be deciding if you like the set or Ada. Remunition equal to its price tag. I like these things, but the more I'm into NFTs and the more... I look into NFTs. I'm just interested in passive income. Like, there's 10 winners and you've got 8,000 NFTs. There's a small chance of me winning. Do you know what I mean? So there's not a very high percentage chance of you winning. Um, so that's why I'm just going to passive income. So we've got play to earn. So yes, you read it right. We're developing a Mahjong application web mobile that allows you to earn while you play. Discussions with developers are currently ongoing. We are stoked. Oh, and did I mention that if you are too busy to play the game, you could rent out your NFT. More details about the game will be released weekly upon project sellout. So I'm very bullish about that. If I could rent out my NFT, that's passive income, right? That's yes, all. So this, this is where a bit of knowledge of the game comes in. So holders with the following hands will receive receiving more in-game rewards. So any secrets, hand 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Three of the same tile, any four of the same tile, achieving 13 orphans. Um, token, our mix is going to have a token as well, coming soon. And that's it for the roadmap. So... This is something I'm interested in because you can rent out your NFT. You know, that is something I am really interested in doing. Passive income is, it's the new buzzword. You know, everybody wants passive income. So, that's fine. I mean, the mint date is the 5th of June, 4 p.m. UTC. The mint price is 55 A there. There's going to be 8,000. And there's only 44 whitelists out of the 200. So if you're interested, you can get in. 
There is about 2,000 people in the Discord, about 2,051 people in the Discord from memory. Um, but yeah, that is 3QY. I say, man, the, the NFTs themselves actually look pretty sick. Have one last quick blast of the art. can see it's nice it's nice art but yeah man stop boy d blockchain finance and value like and subscribe and peace